President Trump is in London today with his family for the third official state visit ever of a sitting U.S. president over in the U.K. After a royal welcoming ceremony at Buckingham Palace and afternoon tea with Prince Charles earlier, the president now preparing for a formal state banquet tonight. But many opposition figures are boycotting the event, and the president set off a Twitter feud as well early this morning with the mayor of London. And that's after Trump waded deep into British politics this weekend in two different media interv interviews. For more on this, we're turning live now to RT correspondent Shadia Edwards Dashti in London. Shadia, how's the reaction in London to this visit? Well, Donald Trump has been welcomed by the Queen here at Buckingham Palace after touching down in the UK just hours ago. But before he even set foot in Britain, he already caused controversy by waging a war of words with London Mayor Sadiq Khan. Sadiq Khan clearly saying no, Britain should not be rolling out the red carpet for Donald Trump. And in response, Donald Trump called him a stone cold loser. Now, Trump's visit, as I say, has come at a controversial time. The Queen was hosting the president earlier today. He then moved on to Westminster Abbey and tonight he will be returning back to Buckingham Palace for an official state banquet, which has also caused controversy because many senior British politicians are boycotting the event, including leader of the opposition Jeremy Corbyn, Liberal Democrat leader Sir Vince Cable and indeed House of Commons leader John Burko. Now, of course, we have to say that no state visit of Donald Trump would come without a mass demonstration of the British public. Of of course, last year we saw his visit receive hundreds of thousands of protesters taking to the street. And to tomorrow we will see something very, very similar with many anti-Trump movements all uniting together to come onto the streets to say no. They have clear messages against his policies, uh, various different issues surrounding the Muslim ban last year, all the way to issues surrounding the Mexican border and other uh, leading activists saying that his policies in regarding gender and women are not to be tolerated here in Britain. Now, as I say, Donald Trump's commentary, he's been a commentator on international affairs, but also domestic affairs here in the UK. So tomorrow we will see the president meeting with Theresa May. Issues that will be probably on the table surrounding things like Brexit. Obviously, Donald Trump looking towards trade deals with the United Kingdom, particularly in a post-Brexit Britain that will come at some point. Many saying Theresa May's meeting with Donald Trump somewhat irrelevant given the fact that she will be leaving her position as prime minister. But as it stands, it is an official capacity of a state visit. And so therefore, it does appear like the special relationship is prevailing. Hey, YouTube, thanks for checking out our channel. We hope you enjoyed the video. We have tons of content for you just like this. For more of RT America's one of a kind news and analysis, be sure to subscribe and never stop questioning more.